Kennedy Carter has once again issued statements believed to be directed towards Caitlin Clark. Even though many WNBA players and legends are out seeking attention using Clark's name, she has always opted to keep it professional and does not respond. If she responds, she does it so professionally leaving her rivals in an awkward position. For Caitlin Clark, her basketball talent speaks for her and not sideshows. Friday night was a momentous occasion for the WNBA as the Chicago Sky clinched a hard-fought 88-84 victory over the Seattle Storm. This game was particularly noteworthy because it featured a record-tying performance by Sky rookie Angel Reese, who further solidified her case in the highly competitive Rookie of the Year race. Reese matched the long-standing record held by Los Angeles Sparks legend Candace Parker for the most consecutive double-doubles spanning multiple seasons, now standing at an impressive 12 games. The post-game atmosphere was charged with excitement and debate, particularly around the Rookie of the Year contention. Sky guard Kennedy Carter did not shy away from making her stance clear. While a segment of fans is rallying behind Indiana Fever rookie Caitlin Clark for the award, Carter is staunchly in favor of her teammate Reese. Her remarks underscored Reese's unwavering consistency and dedication, coupled with a pointed critique of Clark. Barbie's Rookie of the Year There's no other way to put it, Carter declared emphatically. She goes out, she does her work every single night no matter what team we're facing. I'm telling you, Barbie's Rookie of the Year, for sure. Carter's use of the nickname Barbie for Reese adds an interesting dimension to her support, emphasizing not just Reese's performance but also her persona on and off the court. This statement is also loaded with subtext given Carter's history with Clark. Earlier in the season, Carter and Clark were involved in a controversial incident that sparked a wide array of reactions across the league. Many saw it as a cheap shot from Carter towards Clark, fueling speculation that there is lingering animosity between the two players. Carter's recent comments only seem to reinforce this perception. On the court, Reese's performance against the Storm was nothing short of stellar. She amassed 27 points and 10 rebounds, a feat that not only tied her with Parker, but also showcased her ability to perform under pressure. In addition to these impressive stats, Reese made her first two three-pointers of her WNBA career, setting a personal record and demonstrating her versatility as a player. While Reese's contributions were critical to the Sky's victory, Chendi Carter's performance was equally significant. Carter led the team in scoring with 33 points, showcasing her offensive prowess with a remarkable 15 of 24 shooting from the field. Her leadership and scoring ability were pivotal in securing the win for the Sky, underscoring her role as a key player on the team. This game and the ensuing debate highlight the intense competition and drama that define the WNBA. As the season progresses, the Rookie of the Year race will likely continue to heat up, with Reese and Clark at the center of the conversation. Reese's consistent performance and ability to break records position her as a formidable contender, while Clark's fan base and on-court skills make her a significant rival. In the broader context, the rivalry between Reese and Clark, amplified by Carter's outspoken support and previous altercation, adds a layer of intrigue to the season. Fans and analysts alike will be watching closely to see how these dynamics play out, both on and off the court.